Welcome back to Forza Horizon 4, and a couple of months ago, you may remember this little movie called out, you might have seen it, called Ford vs. Ferrari. We actually did this almost nine months ago now in Forza Motorsport 7. In Forza Horizon 4, though, we've got some very very cool car we're gonna split into three different teams one person's gonna be team ferrari one person what four people are gonna be team ferrari four people are gonna be team ford and four people are going to be team port we're gonna try our best to use as close to the cars as we can get from the movie so let me just divide everybody one two three four we will be team ferrari we should all have the car then let's go one two three four Four, you'll be team Porsche. And then one, two, three, four. I will be honest, I am a little bit worried about team Ford. Those four GTs in the game are super, super OP. Yeah, look at team Porsche ready to go. What are these paint jobs that you guys have? I think after all of that, we are officially ready to go to hopefully in my case not replicate the 1966 le mans however it is me so who knows i'll probably flip and roll and roll and roll a lot this is a race that nathan actually made and for it we sort of kind of have a fake le mans start hit the finish line and then turn around because the first checkpoint is behind you it kind of makes it for a jank start but back in the day when le mans had le mans starts where they had to run across the road, get in the car, put their seatbelt on, and then rip it away. It's sort of kind of the same thing for us. Can't you just reverse? I don't actually know if reversing works. Oh, I'm actually in a very unfortunate position here. All right, so you should have about 30 seconds to do this. Nicely done, and away we go for our Le Mans style start. And we are in, and... The positions are literally all over the place right now. <gasps> DJ didn't activate it. DJ's out of it. Hank is out of it. A couple people. I'm about to miss the checkpoint. I'm getting excited. Anyways, as I was saying, those four GTs, as you can probably tell, are pretty powerful. I'm not even joking when I say they are some of the most OP cars in this game. Look for them to do very, very well. Although they have not the best pi they are super quick anyway so i should probably talk about the circuit a little bit nathan actually built this track and it's sort of kind of as close as you can get to le mans in forza horizon 4 we've got this huge huge highway section where you can hit 200 miles an hour or more if you have a better car oh my god I'm pulled a Ferrari! No! I'm literally done of the... No! I'm never, ever, ever... No, I'm not the only one. <laughs> I'm never, ever looking backwards in a race again. Oh, look at the Porsches. Like a sitting duck, bud. Oh, they are so, so slow. I mean, Team Porsche have the fastest drivers out here. So they definitely can have the handicap. They just got to drive super well. Anyways, there's a little chicane down the back street of Le Mans. Sort of kind of reminiscent of some of the stuff around Le Mans, but not, not perfect. It's Horizon at the end of the day. Yo, Nathan is behind though in P7 rocking the Porsche. He's driven around this circuit before. He knows where he's going and he's super quick. If I can keep Nathan behind... I will chalk that up as a victory, please. Keep in mind, that Porsche is like 50 PI points lower than this Ferrari. Well, lap number one, done. And in the books, Team Ferrari, I think, with the best start so far. I wonder what top speed, though, those Porsches are doing because I am running away from Nathan on the straights like mad i'm seven seconds behind the guy in front of me if i could catch up though that would be insane 190 miles an hour though we're closing in on come on whoa ferrari is good 
super good. Oh, and we are closing in on the back of the Ford. There he is up in front of me. Let's go. Yo, we're one second behind. We have closed in so much on the Ford. Keep the pressure up with one lap to go. Yo, he's so much faster than me on the straight. I cannot catch up. Hard, 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 hard on the brakes. Smoke coming out the back of the Ford. A little bit of sideways action from him. And we send it through. Super clean. Round the little chicane. Forenzo. Nicely done. Let's go, Team Ferrari. <gasps> no! Oh, <laughs> my hard work. I drove the absolute wheels out of the Ferrari. Enzo's gonna kill me. I'm, I'm dead. I'm so dead. Yo, Twitch chat is like, pretends to be shocked. <laughs> Why do I do this to myself? Every time. No, 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 mama mia. We pick up the DNF. How do we do on the lap time? We got a 507. Ferrari with the quickest lap time. It's not even close. Yo, those Porsches really really struggled. I mean, hey, I guess that's why the movie's called Ford versus Ferrari and not called Ford versus Ferrari versus Porsche. So for reference, us in the Ferrari, we were doing like 190 miles an hour down the straight. DJ was only doing 163 in the Porsche. Think it's safe to say Ferrari takes the 1966 Le Mans. What if Ford versus Ferrari took place in 2020. Why don't we bring out the brand new stuff? The Ford GT, the Ferrari 488 Pista, and the Porsche 911 GT2 RS. Team Ferrari versus Team Porsche versus Team Ford. Team Ford, I will be honest, I'm a little bit worried for you guys. However, Team Ferrari, we win the PI battle again. Okay, so what's this? Porsche and Ford team up against Ferrari to take him down. What is this? F1 all over again? I gotta be honest. Playground games. Can we please get a feature where we could almost choose the start line for our race so we don't need to do jank moves like this? Forza servers. What is wrong with them today? It's not looking good for the four GTs starting 8, 9th, and 10th. Oh dear. I wish you all good luck. Like I said, make sure you go through the finish line. Then do a Yui, just like DJ did there. La Mas starts, and away we go. I am terrified of those Porsches. Just because, one, I know how fast they are. Two, take a look at who is driving them. How are we currently in 5, 6, 7th right now for Team Ferrari? I don't understand. The Porsches right behind, boys. Keep it going. Oh, man. Yo, these Ferraris in a different league to the ones that we just drove. Sorry, I almost pulled a Sebastian Va uh, Vettel and pushed my teammate. How is everybody going past? Alex, we're supposed to be a team. <laughs> Draft off of them up there. I've never driven with somebody so close at 200 miles an hour before. Hard on the brakes. Yo, the Porsches aren't that quick through the cook. Alex, it's not formula drift. Watch out, Alex. Alex, no. Alex, what are you doing? What a disaster. What an absolute disaster. Oh, Alex, slow down for me. Alex, we have so much time to make up. Just go, buddy. We're on the same team, just put. I think my Lamont dream is <laughs> over. And so is that guy who drove straight into the water. I don't know who that was, but that's a big rip. That was a Porsche. Oh, well, would you look at that? Hello, fire. That was only a couple of quarters later. I don't even know how I caught up to you, but he's rocking the Porsche. I don't know what the top speed of these Porsches are. Yo, we definitely caught up 
a little bit on the Porsche. I think I'm quicker through the corners. Maybe providing I don't drift it around so much. I've never tried to drive so clean in Forza Horizon 4 before. I am pushing so hard for this Porsche right now. Very good battle. Fire runs it deep though into the corner. And that's going to be the easiest overtake of my career up to P6. No way. Yo, that's what happens when you pour the pressure on. Fire chokes under the pressure. I will gladly take that one. No way. The guys are already done. Liam takes it home in P1. DJ in P2. Ank in P3. Okay, nicely done, lads. Oh, uh, okay. <laughs> I've been bit. Oh, so somebody followed me through. No way. The Ford takes it in P1, then a Ford in P4 as well. DJ was like the Ford GT was the best all-round car. Ferrari had the speed. Porsche had the corners. Ford had a little bit of everything. I got. I think you got to give that to Ford. But you know what? Let's do one more. Everybody is all split up pretty nicely, I got to admit. And away we go. Yo, I love Liam's EcoBoost paint job. That looks so good. All right, Ferrari. We are going to need to drive very, very clean here. I've just overtaken DJ. That doesn't happen every day. Oh. Never mind, I spoke too soon. We've got the two Ferraris stuck behind these guys. Come on. Meanwhile, Ank has basically an open road up in front of him for him to rip it around in his Ferrari. Nathan is right behind in the Porsche as well. The Ferrari's racing wheel to wheel with DJ. What a turn of events this is. Yo, I want to get on the podium. Really really badly but if i want to do that i'm gonna need to make some huge moves we're halfway through this race come on get out of the way forward oh and the porsche is right up behind yes yet just oh <laughs> we're slowing each other down boys what a race this is turning out to be Come on, Ferrari! Use the power! Come on! Try to slipstream off the back of the Ford GT. Going on to the final lap. Hard on the brakes. Oh, the active arrow. Oh, we're all upside each other. The Porsche kind of pushed me through and passed it. I hit the curb. No, now the Porsche goes past. No! Get on the brakes. Come on! Come on! The Ford is just bleeding positions right now. This is so close. We've never, ever, ever had races like this. Nathan got so close, so close to missing every single one of those checkpoints. Yo, he knows the layout better than me and how much you can push it. Oh, man. What a beast in that thing. We take home P5. Yo, look at the lap times, though. The Ferraris are just dominant. I think that says it all. I think that wraps it up. Ford versus Ferrari versus Porsche. I'm sorry, boys, but I gotta give it to the Ferraris. I think we need a Ford GT 2.0, or I guess now technically... 4.0 if they want to compete with these guys. But there you go. Ford versus Ferrari in Forza Horizon 4. What a fun thing. Nathan, you built an awesome track, bud.